All right, so we have the grill. Now it's that juicy. is a, It's actually really juicy. Bump. Thank you. Oh, it smells so good. The elbow. <laughs> yeah, go get that door. <laughs> I know, right? Keep going. Bring it into the hole. Yeah, that's a hole in one. Yeah. Five or one. Oh. What's up, you guys? All right, so we are back here at the Oasis RV Resort. Now, we actually did a video a long time ago, which felt like a long time ago. And this resort is probably one of the best, if not the best, RV resort park here in Las Vegas. So we're back to check that out. Now, we got here a little bit late, so we're going to have a little cook sesh tonight. And let's see what Dave is cooking on the menu before we explore what they have to offer here. What's up, Dave? Hey, babe. How are you? Good. What we got cooking? Okay. Well, oh, not cooking no. yet, <laughs> but pretty soon. Got some nice ribeyes. Ooh. Right? We got some onion. Ooh. And I think you're going to whip up a little bit of uh, yellow zucchini, right? Oh, that's or, right. Or summer squash, that's right? That's right. We need some uh, winter squash. Winter squash. Winter, <laughs> winter, winter, winter time here. Yes, exactly. Summer squash in the winter. Exactly. It's going to be awesome, though. I'm uh, excited. I'm starving. All right. So I have to tell you guys, Dave and I, we really enjoy these cooking nights. We enjoy sharing our cooking experiences with you guys. If you want to see a recipe or we should try something that you think we'd really enjoy, let us know in the comment section below. Tonight is going to be something pretty simple. Ish, I guess you would say. I'm making like summer winter squash with my special rub that I have for it. Then we're gonna have a white onion sliced thickly with the same rub and olive oil to kind of grill. But I think Dave has something special tonight he's gonna use on tonight's steak. So go out there and take a look and I'll meet you guys out there in a minute. So we have some ribeyes tonight, but uh, I wanna actually put a little uh, post oak in there tonight. Gonna smoke it just a little bit, get a little bit of that smoky flavor in the ribeye. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, had a great day with Tanya today. Super lucky, Tanya is incredible. Very lucky guy. And hopefully I do a good job with the steaks tonight and she has a wonderful dinner because uh, it'll be a great ending to the day. All right, so we have the grill started up and Tanya's inside cutting some uh, zucchini and onions. So just getting this started. And after dinner, we're gonna enjoy ourselves a little uh, propane fire pit. Should be a nice night. It's actually really cooling off. Right babe, maybe it's cooling off. A lot. Oh, it's definitely cooling off. The fire pit's gonna be all nice, and so is dinner. Maybe a glass of wine. That sounds I feel good. Like to a me. glass of wine is might be in order, huh? Sounds good to me, babe. Let's do it. Sounds good with steak. <laughs> Should we try this steak? Dig in. So I can smell that post oak is just uh, really get ready for a little smoky. Kind of a, few, <laughs> a, a little smokiness. <laughs> bit of smoke it is. Mmm. Mmm. That is that really good. Really good, isn't it? Now it's that juicy. is. A, it's actually really juicy. It's delicious. Yeah. Wonderful. Right. Yeah. It's like the perfect ending to this night. It, it is. Quite the evening. Nice start here to the oasis. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How'd you sleep? Slept so pretty well. Yeah. Just in time to get some breakfast. Yes. So, I'm ready. I'm you hungry. I am. I'm wondering if they still serve the breakfast here. Now it's been a while. All right, time for that first cup of coffee, baby. Oh yes. The first cup of coffee. Are we going to bring this over there? I think so. Yeah. I'm off for that. Can't can't imagine they have pumpkin spice <laughs> and everything nice kind of coffee over there. So thank you. Oh, it smells so good. Mmm. That first sip tastes heavenly. Thank you for the coffee. So we're in luck, the Oasis Cafe is open. Actually, it was pretty 
empty as well as you can see behind. They're open from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. on Fridays and Saturdays, and 7 a.m. to 2. And actually, when you're at the cafe, you are basically right next to the pool. Come out here, and it's a beautiful morning here in Vegas. But check out this pool area. We're definitely gonna go down there and check it out. Now, not all pools are gonna be open this time of year, but we know, at least in the past, there was one pool open, and of course, there's also a really nice hot tub. So, you know what you want yet, babe? I do, actually. I am. Um... I'm gonna get the usual. I guess every time we come here, it's the, like the same thing. What's well, a daily breakfast special? Eggs, bacon, hash browns, and English muffin. It's a great way to kick off the day. I think I think we should then go for a walk and explore. Because I know around this time of year too, a lot of folks tend to put up holiday, you know, right, things that's around. Right. Well, that looks like perfect. Now, what did you get? Wait a second. The same thing. I told you. I know. It looks, looks, it looks, it looks really wonderful. good. Yeah, I mean the breakfast here has always been solid and consistent. And I don't expect to be any different today, so. Is that a smiley face on there? That's a small one. It will be. Watch Could this. Be. Now it is. Two eyes. Oh, I see what you're doing there. And a bacon smiley face. Oh, it's there we go. You got a hidden Mickey right there, I think. That's a hidden Mickey. That's a hidden Mickey. Good call, hidden Mickey. Well, bye-bye, Mickey. Oh, boy. <laughs> So here in the clubhouse, there's actually a couple of rooms um, outside of the breakfast spot we were just in. They have a place here called Hollywood Theater, and if you go inside, it's actually a place designated for conferences, but they hold movie nights. They kind of hold movie nights here as well, which is kind of cool. And then there's a ballroom that's just to the left of us, um, which looks like another conference room store where you can play a little bit of games, slot machine games back there, as well as just get some items. And it's right next to the pool area, which we'll check out after we do a lap around this place, because this place is huge. And so far, it's still pretty dang good. So last minute, just bought two tickets to see The Who tonight in Vegas. We actually had other plans. The Who was the uh, first album I ever bought was Who's Next, going way back. But I gotta let uh, Tanya know, hopefully, hopefully she's excited to see The Who tonight. This might be our last chance to see him. Hey babe, uh, I gotta tell you something, we have change of plans. What? I just got two tickets. Don't tell me, The Who. Yes, ah! yeah, I'm going to The Who, can you believe it? I know, I went to my resale site and just, I had to do it. I just had to do it. I know. I have so we're going in, so. Oh, I was praying that was what it was. Right? Holy cromongas, we're going. All right, so. All right. All right, well, I'm already Let's almost ready. Oh, look at you, you're ready, you're ready. Hey, I'm me. ready for the show. Now I'm really ready for fight tomorrow, yeah. Let's do da, it. Da, 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 a little da, Ryan Daltrey and uh, Townsend. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like <laughs> I'm that. excited. Let's, Let's go. Let's do it. Let's go. So we had a great time last night singing and dancing to the Who tunes. Tiny was really getting down on Who Are You? But, uh, I mean, they're all great. Bob O'Reilly won't get fooled again. Great stuff. So, Tiny, had a good time last night? Or what? I had so much fun. Who are you? Exactly. Hey. A lot of fun. It was it was well worth seeing the show last night. Now I feel like I'm on a high. I'm like, yay, we saw the show last night. Exactly. Now I'm making some break break breakfast. A little <laughs> breakfast. A beautiful beautiful day here at the Oasis. Day. Yeah, so I'm gonna make bacon and eggs. Awesome, babe. Well, Tanya cooks breakfast. I'm actually gonna add some water into our tank. We're getting pretty low right now. We're down to about five percent in the tank, so I'm gonna add a little bit. Do not want to run out of water tonight. I'm a very lucky man. Look at that. Perfect breakfast. Hey, thanks, babe. You're so welcome. I appreciate it. Of course. All right. Happy breakfast. Happy breakfast. You know what I want to say? What, babe? So this spot in the campground, although you think, okay, this is kind of close to the front at the Oasis, I feel this is a really great spot for a camper van our size. And you have trees, block out a lot of the sun, heavy sun. But then there's like a mini golf course right behind you, plus access to like the indoor activities, store, the restaurant if you choose. I think it's a great spot. I mean, it is. And like you said, you have the, and they refer to it as the professional 18 hole putting course. Professional. Not sure, it makes it professional. Not sure it's professional, but, but it's it right is behind a us. great little putting course right behind you. So we've been exploring a little bit of the Oasis, uh, just walking around, seeing if we see some of the folks that we met here before that come here on a regular basis. Unfortunately, we haven't. But right here, this section is a really nice section. It's right by the dog park, as you can see right here. 
but these sections actually have a community grill so you have like an outdoor grill if you want to do some charcoal grilling which is nice but then they have like the, the, the kind of the dog walking area and then there's games over there all right so Davis figured out what this one is I think right well I think it's bocce right you probably bocce. throw probably throw the ball and then try to get as close to the ball you throw with yours as possible and then you actually where well, you get these items is you can get them in the, the uh office area I think right? so I think so we'll have to maybe try a little bocce yeah I certainly know on the uh the putting green you get them in there for sure yes not sure if you got to bring your own like bocce right the putting greens you get it from the, the store exactly the store. And maybe, maybe yeah. that's where all the equipment is hmm. yeah we can ask. we'll have to find out and then there's the dog park off in the distance right over there yeah and then of course you have a little gazebo area which is kind of sitting yeah so this is the community area right here they have like picnic tables options for games here it looks like there's a section for competitive horseshoeing going on behind me and then over there is the dog park which is a really nice little spot for the doggies i'm not quite sure it's one of those like skeet balls or whatever you call those things now if you have a pet especially a dog in this area make sure you pick up after your dog they do have strict surveillance here and if they catch you not picking up after your dog on camera then you're gonna have to pay a 25 dollars fine so just pick up after your pooch you'll be happy and so will they And they actually have a really nice gym here as well. So if you want to get your workout on, come on over. Oh, Tanya's got it going. Get it on. So after walking around this massive place here, I think we should try some food, don't you think? Absolutely. I'm try the restaurant. I'm pretty sick with the restaurant, aren't you? I am. Yeah. You know what's so funny? Close oh, oh. You were the one that got, wanted me to go to Iowa. I, uh, what was it? 250? What was it? What's like that? 80. Iowa 80, did you go to Iowa 80? And then, Isn't it awesome? The one that scared me from going to the top of the strip because I was going to go there. Oh, to Circus Circus? Oh, yeah. No. Well, then the pl practical joke you played on her. That was, oh, that that was, was mean. That was, that was terrible. So it's yeah. coming. It's I'm, a hated, I'm a hated person. So I was doing that. I come across from Toronto. Oh. Okay, we were, we were almost 4,000 miles. So I was doing all the things that you guys were doing just to try it because it's my first time. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. And I was going to bring my car. <gasps> Ricky on the road. Ricky on the road. Is that, is that the terminology? Yeah. Well, we were rookies on the road a year ago, so. Really? Yeah. You guys look like veterans. Come Thank on. you. We're working on it. Mm -hmm. That's called the geekism. We do I a lot of weaning. I got my. It's just me and my two puppies, my little border collies, yeah. uh, for, which are yeah, they're on. They're, they oh, that's me. awesome. And my cat, but I didn't bring my cat because right. he can't travel too well. Yeah. So. But no, this is this is such a great coincidence. Ooh, yeah, where would like to where everything? We get to have a nice little dinner. I'm excited. All right, so much uh, for cooking in the rig. I know. We're giving this a. Uh, this uh, spot here, a real test. Yeah. Breakfast and dinner, we'll let you know how it is. Yeah, we had steak, we made steak on the grill. Yeah, nice. that's true. Nice little separation, just to kind of let somebody else And you made some eggs, too, so you made some eggs. So breakfast. Yes, we've, yeah, so we've been cooking. We've been cooking. <laughs> here it is, a little BLT. That's a little, that's and, a big BLT. And there's a lot here. And what's, what's cool, too, you got homemade chips right here. These are great. I'm gonna take one of those down with a yeah. homemade chip. Nothing wrong with this. What do you get, babe? Mm. So I got, well, that chip is really good by the way, but I got a turkey burger with tater tots. And I've had these here before. So delicious. Tater tots. Mm, and crunchy. Mm, 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 mm. The food is very good here. One of the cool things about the Oasis RV Resort, it's probably one of the coolest pools we've seen in an RV Resort so far, is this one right here. It actually has two massive size pools, a family pool and an adult pool. And the adult pool is also heated, so it's got year-round swimmage going on there and a hot tub. Now, one of the coolest features we've seen here is that natural sand beach that it has. Two couple tiki huts and there's a waterfall feature as well. It just feels like a oasis. I think they kind of concentrated their oasis factor right here at the pool. Unfortunately, right now it is closed because they're renovating it to make it prettier. And I think it's going to be opening up very soon, uh, reopening up again very soon. But I just think it's one of those really cool features. Dave, do you remember that time we uh, enjoyed the pool here and did the pool test? Oh, absolutely. That was awesome. Let me show you. We're about to go where we should probably not be going when it's cold outside. Oh, oh this is not bad. Not too bad. It's not bad. Woo. Oh, not super, yeah. It's not super warm. No. No. This 
place is great, babe, right? I the know. Oasis Bar. Cool. Good spot. You know, reasonably priced, which is uh, surprised by it. Actually, very good price. Decent quality food for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Uh, of course, right now it's closed. The, the hours do vary a bit, yes. right? But uh, sometimes it's only for dinner, sometimes for kind of breakfast, we've lunch. we enjoyed a lot of them. One of the benefits of this place too is that you're super close to Las Vegas. So if you want to kind of see the strip and do things, you can kind of only do a 10, 15 minute drive and you're right there inside of Las Vegas Center Strip. <laughs> hey, about the hey. hit, man. I got the golf. Oh. Hey. We got two balls up. Oh, are we about to play some mini golf? A little, putt, a little mini golf. A little putt, a little mini. Oh, mm. another another benefit. It's been a long time. It has been. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't damage any cars. Woo! All right, so this first one, Davo. Look how far it is. That's a long straight one. For like... I think I can you, do it. You got this. I babe. think I can do it. You got this. Here we go. Boom! It has been dropped. Oh, you dropped it. I dropped it. You got it. Here we go. All right, not bad. <laughs> Europe. Oh boy, look at that form. Whoa! Okay, there I am right there, and I don't have much distance to cover. Just right here in this abnormal sort of looking, uh, yeah, is that, is, is there even a hole there? Here's Dave's, uh, landed all the way in the way it's kind of beyond the putting hole, but right here, so you can still do it on two if you can get out of this jungle. Now, I will say the hole's a little bit overgrown. Okay, you ready, baby? I'm ready. So while Dave is grabbing his putter, they do have an 18 hole sort of putting range here, which is quite interesting to make all 18. I wonder how different each one of them shall look. <laughs> it's because right now, this one's kind of crazy. Ooh wee, Dave, look at that. That was trouble. Really buried in some it's buried. forest. Oh man! Oh, <laughs> back oh wow! Direction. Not bad. I guess. You got it out of the. At least you got it out of the forest. <laughs> right. All right, you got this, babe. All right, come on. Can I make it three? Can I make it three? You got Let it. Let it be. <laughs> oh, this is terrible. This is why we don't play golf. <laughs> Five hours later, exactly. first <laughs> hole. Is it going back into the forest, you guys, or is it gonna stay? Oh, it's gonna, oh! All right. Nice. Oh, man! So that was four. Five. Oh, finish. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Nice job. Hole in one, hole in one. <laughs> Keep going! Bring it into the hole. Woo! Hey, there you go, that's a hole in one. Yeah. Five or top one. Nice job, Thank you. Oh. All right. All right, let's roll it on. Now, apparently there's 18 holes here, right? But you have to go into the pool area. I was just saying that earlier. Right? Like 18 holes. So let's see. Let's see. Continue on. Ooh, here we go. Back to the next tee. Oh, no. Aww. Yeah, still like this is being redone, so. So that is the end of golf for today. End of the golf, but beautiful, actually beautiful holes right around the pool area here. Yeah, there's 15 right there. That would yeah. be number 15. And it wraps around that beautiful pool area. Oh, Dave, I guess we'll have to call it a tie. Sounds good to me. I'll take a tie. <laughs> hey, babe. Yeah. I just got uh, details of the price increase you're hearing about for the monthly folks. Yeah. And it's pretty shocking. I mean, it's big increases. Are you kidding me? Apparently each rates increasing 200 bucks a month, which effectively increases at like 20 to 30%. Wow. I mean, that's a big increase to, for folks. I mean, now the top rate for the biggest rig is like 1300 a month, Holy which is, I mean, that's a big, big that's jump. And then jump. the cheaper one went from 690 all the way to 890. Wow. And already you're talking like the daily rates are about a hundred dollars. You know, if you're doing daily. Oh yeah, the dailies are huge. They're pretty expensive. Right, and they also it. have this, like, as we talked about this uh, Raider weekend rate Raider here. Raider weekend, which, that's shocking. Yeah, exactly. When you have, when the Raiders are playing hometown folks, watch out here, because the rates really spike up on those weekends. They call them Raider weekend pricing. You know, yes, that's a big price increase for sure um, but it's one of those things where times are changing price increases are going up everywhere as a matter of fact these folks have said they haven't raised the prices here in almost four right, or five that's years true. and you get all of these amenities from the pool to the golf to the restaurants to being 10 minutes from Vegas plus a little mini golf I mean you can't yeah. go wrong it's no like it's one of our it, favorite spots yeah it's definitely a great spot outside of Vegas but I don't know about you babe 
I am getting anxious to start exploring. Yeah, me Again, too. I think it's time to hit the road and head into some snow. I like that. See, we, we got the desert. Now it's time to put the snow to desert snow. <laughs> <laughs> Let's rock.